How do you feel about the breakaway thing? I think it's an interesting mechanic. Um, I'm, I think the breakaway system, like, it's interesting because essentially you can't break or someone if you're on the ground, right? You have to break away. So like maybe like grounded, like it's it's gonna be like it's gonna be harder to like actually break out of certain combos because some stuff like you can get punished with like for example Brock is like one one two into like his uh, back four two and you could if that's a crushing blow you're not gonna be able to break break that you're gonna you're gonna die you know. Look at that move. So that's that's interesting, I think. Do you think there's a chance of Ermac making the roster? Potentially. Alright, anyways. I think this was actually a really good set between Rewind and Sonic. And it just shows how quickly they can pick up something because... Oh, that was an anti-air, actually. That was really good. Because the thing is, is like, we only got like 30, 30 to 45 minutes to play. And like these, like I, I expected Sonic Fox to pick it up really quickly, and I kind of expected Rewind too as well because they're both those types of players. So I had a feeling their set was going to be really good, and they were actually playing together. They were actually like playing each other to prepare for the match, so that they both ha were somewhat familiar with the other characters' moves and stuff. So they knew like how, like what they wanted to look out for, how to actually have like a good match and stuff. You can see right here, Sonic Fox. Like, he actually interrupted this string right here. Like, where is it? He's gonna... That, that move from Aiden actually looks really good, too. Where is it? This character seems a little bit different. It seems maybe a little bit more like... See, I think right here. Yeah, look, he interrupts the string. Boom, boom. He, like, that shit that you do, like, after, like, quite a bit of, like, like, playing the game and understanding it. So, like, yeah, they were, like, playing together and actually, like finding stuff out together so that they could actually put on a good show, which is nice. Like, when I fought Hayate, like, I had no idea what Scorpion was capable of. He probably didn't know what Baraka was capable of, but it didn't really matter. <coughs> Did it. Thanks for all the new follows, guys. I don't know if that move is uh, punishable or not, because Rewind was using it a lot. Ouch, look at that. 23%. I think that's a throw. Raiden looks pretty cool in this game. I, I kind of like how he looks. That's a nice looking throw. That's very interesting. Like, Raiden can actually, like... He can actually, uh... His Superman move, he actually goes back and then goes forward. I wonder if he can cancel that or not. If he could cancel it, that would be like pretty freaking strong. Like right here? Wait, no. Am I missing something? I don't know. Okay, maybe I, I, I skipped to the wrong part. I don't know. This, but this is one thing. Thing though, like the fatality. See how he he hits her, and then she just explodes like that. Part of me kind of wishes that I could see the limbs flop on the floor, and just I, I kind of want to see that. I kind of want to see the limbs like fall on the floor, but then you don't see it because they do this whole slow mo thing. In some situations, I think it's nice, but in some situations, I feel like man, I kind of want it to like play out. I kind of want to see like you know the end but you can't see it like because it's like so slow-mo i'm sure i'll get used to it in some situations i do think it looks nice you know but yes sometimes i kind of want to see it i like the, the 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 generic like mortal combat do something crazy and like you just raise your hand and pose i think it's kind of funny what's up germ ball Famous Fox already misses running in MK. Well, you could just play MKX if, like, you really just want to run. <laughs> like, I'm fine with running, not uh, not being in the game. At first, it does take a little bit of time to get used to that movement, but like, I think overall, like, it does make the neutral more important. It makes footsies a lot more important, and I like that about the game. I think most most like top players like that. That's interesting that Rewind already found like a way to like anti-air without using down twos. 
It's a pretty slow chase down for Sonic Fox, as you can see. I mean, those buttons out of Raiden are, are big. Right. Yeah, very fast forward movement. So they actually put gave Sonic Fox the, uh, it says he, they gave him, like, the, the point or whatever, but he didn't win that first match. It was Rewind. Oh, yeah, Rewind has, like, that anti, uh, Raiden has that anti-air grab. He uses some lightning. I think he used it at some point in the set. It looked pretty cool. He, saw, he got the gap there, like before he would punish him. <laughs> Why do they give NA players such little time to practice? I don't know, man. I really don't know. I really feel like they should have given us more time. But like, I, I am still happy that like, like that they they had exhibitions. I'm happy that I was part of it. You know, like I don't want to seem ungrateful or anything, but I do. Th that was pretty clutch from Sonic. He would have been down 2-0. If he didn't get him with that. Um, but yeah. I'm happy that I was part of it and everything. And I'm grateful like that I was. I, but I do wish that they gave us uh, more time. What's up, Neko? Look at this combo. He already had a corner combo. 30%. It's so impressive that these guys, I mean, that, these guys are Evo champions. I think, and he almost picked that up too. But he dropped it. I think he, he probably could have, like, uh, killed him if he... Finish that combo right there. Did you see more than the roster? Because Sonic's main was Rain and Tweety's was Jade on the board. That they, they just asked us what characters we want to main essentially in MK11, but it's saying that. Does, does not mean anything like it just means that sonic wants rain it doesn't mean rain's actually in the game but like i think like it's lots of people are speculating that rain will be in the game because rain was on like one of the screens when you're like in the menu system so like a lot of people are suspecting rain will be there um but yeah like that doesn't mean anything i think someone like made, made a video saying like how rain is in and they use that like that sonic fox's thing said rain as one point but like, yeah, that's not, uh, that doesn't mean anything. But see, I feel like their movement really isn't that bad in this. Like, it's, it's, it's footsies, you know? It's, I think this is actually like solid, solid gameplay. They were definitely a cool feature in MKX. I hope they're back. Okay, okay. I think it's kind of crazy though that like a crushing blow you can get like, I, I don't know how I feel about being able to have a crushing blow from your opponent, like, trying to tech wrong, or your opponent holding block if they shouldn't hold block, or some shit like that. I don't know how I feel about that. Like, I feel like I kind of want crushing blows to be more so a thing that you control, not, like, you, your opponent fucking up. But then, like, it just makes it so much more important. That, that's crazy. You get 30% for that crushing blow. Um, but, yeah, it makes it more important, I guess, just to, like, to, to understand, like, what, like, the crushing blows are for all these characters, or else you're just gonna accidentally do something and fucking die. So that's kind of crazy. So you have an incentive to not... Try, I guess. Very cool. if you know, if like that exactly right there, I think is a crushing blow because oh, Sonic Fox teched the wrong way. Are, like, really good in this game. Yeah, it seems like a lot of characters have great hitboxes on it. That was the beginning of Superman right nice. there. Nice. See, he, he, he uh, already getting whiff punishes and stuff. That's really good. Thank you for the uh, follow, Kazuma. Nope. That was an anti air? You had anti airs? Oh, that move just shuts you down. Like, you're not. Wow. Moving. You can't jump through. So I thought that the hitbox was at the bottom oh, of the screen, no, but it's the is... actual lightning. Now, Raiden, it's not tracking. Raiden has to know close, medium, or far, but yeah, that's that's definitely a do not move, sir. Wow. Oof. Like, when you guys watch this, do you guys really think, like, this is too right. slow? Oh, great tech. Like, do you guys think this These is too slow paced? Because the thing is, is like, it's only gonna speed up because this is like, this is 30 minutes of them playing the game, right? Like, they're only gonna get quicker. Like, it's gonna be quicker than this. So like, I think it's pretty good. The only thing I would change is just to make dashes like a little bit faster. I think back dashes right now seem kind of useless because they don't really go anywhere and they don't seem to have invincibility frames on them. So like, back dashes in this current build seem useless. Four dashes also seem kind of useless. Like, see this, Sonic Fox is dashing there. 
He's not really moving. He has 0.1 health right now. Does he win this with 0.1 health? Look at that damage though. That's a lot of damage. 45%. Oh, that was sick. I, I remember that now. And he did that into uh, his own fatal blow. Let's 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 look at that a little again. That was pretty sick. That's pretty sick. That's good. Like he already like the awareness to like use the teleport in that situation, like that clutch play. That's good. That's good. Yeah, the dash is, I think is 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 too slow. I think the move, like the walk speed and stuff, is is good. Look at that. And that's one of those situations where I guess you just don't have any other options, right? That's pretty cool. Or actually, you know, I, I'm not sure exactly how much that meant, but if he had blocked that perfectly, if he'd done the flawless block, could he have survived Chip instead of... We'd have to look. I'm guessing he still would have died. I don't, okay. I don't remember exactly how much he had. So that doesn't avoid Chip death. It anything. doesn't avoid it completely or Chip death, but it does do significantly less. Okay. It, it really does matter. I just don't remember that. Like, I have to see that In thing. that situation, okay. by the way, they're talking about whether Sonic Fox could have like flawless blocked and lived. He only had 0.1 health. If he flawless blocked, I think he still would have died. Because I know I tested at one point, like, a move did, like, a 4.5% or 4.5 chip damage and then if you blocked it did 0.45 so I'm pretty sure flawless blocking does like 10% uh, reduces it basically by 90% but I think Sonic Fox still would have died in that situation if you have 0.1 health and then you flawless block I think you'd still die that's right you could have done it huh I guess maybe he wants to save it for the next game if he right. has a life. He must next be round, confident he's going to win this round anyway, so we'll right. see if he does. What a cool decision you have to make. Uh, yeah, it's a very, Ooh. very cool meta. Wow. And he did. So Plus he was right. Tech. He was right. So now if he's in a bad spot, or if he can yeah, I'm not. I'm not sure how I feel about like the uh, the uh, health being like 1,000. I would have rather it just like be what it is, and then it just like has percent. But then the thing is, is like you wouldn't be able to see ex like directly on the uh, the screen. Like it, what is it gonna say? Like that they have like 11.3 health. Like 11.3% health left. I don't know. Like I, I, I. Oh, that was crazy. See, that was the anti-air grab. I think. Um. I think as long as it, like having it say like 430 damage is fine, as long as the health remains at 1,000 for all characters. I hope that they don't have like. I don't really want characters to have different. Uh, like health numbers and stuff. I don't want something to be like 950, you know, 1100, 1400. I don't want that um, to be in the game. I hope it just stays at a thousand health for everyone. Try the fatal blow after that. Two two. Going down to the end. I think this is exactly what we expected from these two players. Yeah. I, whoever wins, they're definitely going to hug. There's definitely going to be a hug. There's just no doubt there's going to be a hug. <laughs> and I think Sonic Fox actually has a cold, so he'll transfer that with the hug. Okay. To rewind. So apparently Sonic was saying that Sonya doesn't really have any plus frames, though, which he does, he's not a big fan of. Because he wants, if, if, you have, if you have a pressure character, right? Or like if you have like a, a rushdown character or whatever, you, like having plus frames is a pretty important thing so that you can like pressure people. And he was saying that Sonya didn't really have that. But look at that, co like that's pretty cool how he already came up with like a, he came up with that corner combo and like was executing it pretty consistently in tournament or well, you know, like in an exhibition within like 30 minutes of play. So that's pretty cool. That didn't seem like a cancel either, that just looked like a link. Sonic's in a lot of trouble. Is Sonic going to lose his first set? Is Sonic going to start his 11th career? Ooh. Look at that. Jump back Ooh, one or something. Damn. That was a crushing oh, blow. Jump back one into the into the down. Superman, and that did like 28% or something. That's crazy. Yeah, there he goes. Confirmed from Rewind. He's got corner. Oh, that'll be a combo. You can actually mash two oh, to keep wow. that going, but Sonic's not I think that's it. a throw. He may want the restand or he just doesn't know because it's early. That is that's so sniped him out of the air. That lightning, that lightning seems pretty strong. But I think I think you have to control where that goes. Sonic just inching his way in. Rewind doing a great job with the zoning. Mm-hmm. Maybe a little panic on the teleport though. Oof. 
confirmed properly. And back to trying for the zoning game, but Sonic Fox is a big threat. Oh, oh wow, that was a precarious, precarious jump. Mm -hmm. All right, we're gonna end it with some brawling here. Fatal Bulls there. That was just enough life to get it, too. Great situation right now in terms of that resource for Rewind. I think the way Raiden looks that when he teleports is actually a pretty cool yeah, animation. You know Rewind wants to hit that trigger because it will kill this one problem. That would have been it, but he, he dropped the combo. I, re I think one thing that they weren't really doing in this set, though, was actually uh, using the breakaway mechanic. I feel like there was a couple instances where they could have used it and they just didn't. Literally probably three frames or so from losing this exhibition. Well, that was a great set. That's exactly what we want from these two guys. That was super close. Here's a hot take.